Welcome to our demonstration on how to perform a file-level restore using VMware vSphere Data Protection. In this demonstration, you'll see how easy and intuitive it is to restore a file or folder using nothing more than a supported web browser. To begin, we log in with an account that has local administrative permissions on the virtual machine where we will be performing the file-level restore. Here we see a list of available restore points for this virtual machine. Note that it is possible to filter the list of restore points by date to quickly locate a specific restore point. In this case, we select the most recent restore point, click Mount, and then click Close. We expand the mount point and see that there are two disks that make up this virtual machine. We expand disk 2, which is our D drive, go to Program Files, select the Data folder, and click Restore Selected Files. Now we must select a destination for the restore. In this case, we simply want to restore the folder to its original location, so we expand the D drive. Now we select Program Files and click the Restore button. We confirm that we want to initiate the restore by clicking Yes and then OK. To view the progress of the file level restore, click Monitor Restores. Here you can see information about the restore job, such as the current status, the start time, and how much time has elapsed since the job was started. Once the restore is complete, you can also see the end time. This concludes our demonstration on performing a file-level restore with VMware vSphere Data Protection. Thank you.